I'm back. Man, life's been interesting since the last time I posted on here. Um, I've gotten hired at GameStop permanently now, and I'm going to be selling some of my artwork per, uh, on ArtPal now, which I'm still setting up, but it might be a while before that's available. Um, I'll have a link either below in the description if I set it up before I upload this, or um, if I have it set up afterwards, I'll post it in the comments and I'll pin it. You may recall that in November of 2019, I said I was quitting YouTube, and, well, I still sort of am, but let me explain. I'm giving up on YouTube in a sense of I don't want it to be a way for me to make a name for myself. I don't really want to use it to grow on social media. It's not really all that important to me anymore. Um, not that it ever really was, but it's less important than it was before. Um, but I am still going to use it as a creative outlet from now on, and mainly because I've missed making YouTube content. Posts are still going to be few and far between, most of it being just whatever I feel like making at the time. You know, one month it might be a weird podcast thing, and another month it might just be a bunch of vlogs from when I'm at work and there's nothing to do. All I know is that I want to continue to make things for this platform, but not make anything out of this platform. I don't want to appease the algorithm or follow trends, I'm just going to do my own thing and just kind of roll with it. Now about that video I uploaded the other day. A friend of mine by the name of Jen, who is an amazing person, you should go check out her Twitch, I'll leave that link below. She'd invited me to a Discord that was made to organize a surprise for one of her Twitch mods, whom goes by Xfile. I linked his Twitch below as well, he's awesome. The surprise was going to be a YouTube video showcasing a bunch of art that her community made for him and to show appreciation for all that he does for her in the community. And I had offered to edit it all together and post it on my channel. And with the help of Jen, I got to work editing. The deadline was initially that evening around 5 p.m. Central Time, but that got moved due to a snowstorm that knocked out X-Files internet connection, and it got moved to the next day around the same time. Um, and it took about 8 hours total of video editing, 2 hours of work in Paint.net to get all the art situated in the way that I wanted it to be, and about 4 hours of work in Blender because the animation was just giving me trouble for the uh, t scrolling text toward the end of the video. And I'm happy to say it turned out great, um, and the re reward was even better. It was amazing seeing something I helped make have that much of an emotional impact on someone in that way. And I'd like to thank Jen and her amazing community for giving me the opportunity to edit that video because it helped me realize I genuinely enjoy editing and problem solving for a project with a lot of moving parts. And it also helped me realize what I'm good at and what I'm not so good at. So from now on I'm making videos just for fun, and in the spirit of that I'm going to be trying to stream more over at my Twitch channel since lately I've been neglecting it and I really do want to get back to it. And I really do hope you guys are ready for a hell of a ride this year, because I know I am. Oh, uh, one more thing. Uh, since you made it to the end of the video, I'm going to assume that you care enough to hear this. I'm trying to get enough cash together to go to TwitchCon in San Diego this year so that I can meet some longtime friends and even some of you guys and also make some YouTube content while I'm there. I'll need about a grand total for the whole trip, and uh, if you guys are feeling generous, I'll leave a link below to my uh, paypal.me and uh, leave an address in the comment so I can send you some art and some goodies along with it. Um, I'll catch you guys later. Peace.